this my side today? Hi, Hi. everyone. Yes, it is. Um, today, just we're almost chat. twins, can you tell? We're wearing the same plan. shoes. We didn't mean to wear the same shoe, but it does prove we have our own pair, doesn't it? <laughs> and we didn't mean to wear the same colour, but this is what I want to wear today. And that's what you want to wear today, so here we are. What can you do? So today we're going to be talking about the different legs of our black pants because I think online when you look at them it just looks like a pair of black pants and you kind of can't really show what each one suits and what it's there for so today we thought we'd sort of yeah. suss it all out for you and use inside. Yeah, showcase, explain, highlight so you really get what, you, what you're actually buying when you want to buy. Absolutely and being black it's hard to see. It can be stuff. hard to see online, and everyone's Actually, monitors are a bit see. different. We haven't got our lights on. We're no, I've just changed your lighting plan. Okay. You know? All right, just, so we're good. We're, we're good. good. We're good. She's on to it. It's okay. I'm on to it. Now, yeah, I'm going to so get everybody right. up so we can see all your wonderful comments, which make us so happy. Yeah, we, it keeps us on track, actually. There so we are. we've got three groups with three different styles. But should I talk about my... You, you didn't wear a pair. No, well, well that would really look really weird. That's right. We would look really weird. Okay, so I have the jogger on. Uh, the black jogger and it's in a size 8 and I'm always an 8 and I kind of like it. Usually I take my pants in because they're a little bit too big for me because I have thin legs but I love the fact they're a little bit on the loose side and I like the fact that I can cuff them up and make it a bit more joggy at the bottom. Absolutely. And to get this look you can always go up a size or just go your size because Lauren gets the 8 and she looks I just the same. down a size. Straight, straight so, in. I'm just like, exactly the same. I wore mine in the white because this is the pan you all went nuts for in the white. It's completely sold out. Not one left. So yesterday, if you want to see them on me worn a little bit tighter than my normal size, the live yesterday shows me moving about so you get a real gist. Then and then today Faye's wearing the eight, she was wearing the white on some yeah, time. But I it's strange. Know. Lauren's a, a size bigger than At me. At least. But we kind of look the same, so just go your size. Forget everything I've said, go your size and look just like this. Mm. Yeah, definitely. Right? And yeah. if your size isn't there, really, you could size down. Now the other thing that you can't tell from our photos is the type of fabric. It is so soft and beautiful. It feels you so good to so wear. Good sort of like a soft satin. It's not like, if it, people know what Bengaline is, Bengaline can be quite crispy and like a cotton crunchy feel. This is super soft like a satin. Mm. It's beautiful. It's and got like a suede. Because it is a cotton. Yes, yes. It's got like a suede finish on it as well. So it feels lovely and soft and a bit luxe. I don't know if I can do anything to make you no, see I don't that. Think so. You can hardly see the details. It does have the diagonal lines across the thighs to swing them down, girls. You can't see it in a pic, but you can in real life. Yeah, yeah, that's right. And actually, this pant is so... Well, any of these pants, because they're all actually in the same fabric, which is why we're filling you in. But this pant as well is really good to wear in very hot weather. It's a cotton, so it's really, really breathable. That's right. Um, it has a bit of a less stain, but it's much cooler than jeans. The lightweight jeans, much cooler. Oh, much, much, much cooler. Totally, totally. Yes. So they're, they're a great summer the pant. Sorry, they're exactly the same fabric as the white. I've just noticed a comment there. Exactly the same fabric as the white. Yeah, yeah. So, um, a lot of you had asked if it was coming on in black too, and then the and white disappeared, and here it is. And here's black. We haven't brought bring it forward actually because yeah. the white sold so fast. So, well, we should get going. My I mean, blouse, pretty blouse. We'll talk about our outfits okay, first. Yeah. We usually do. I've got, got to say, it's called yeah, the Femme blouse. The Femme blouse. It's so pretty. Don't you think it's pretty? I'm not a pretty person, but I think this looks pretty good. I've made the sleeves, I've brought the sleeves up with my armbands because I want them a little bit more voluminous because that's the look. And all this prettiness, prettiness across the back is um, gorgeous. I, I made it a bit more me with my stilettos and my, you know, jewellery, but um, I, I meant to wear a belt, I forgot. But anyway, it's a pretty blouse and it's that beautiful silky fabric. And, and if you actually want to say that, you wear it actually undone. undone, I'll show you undone. I actually think it's part of that Victorian look yes, to wear it done up. Definitely. But if you don't like it done up, that's cool. You can wear it undone nicely enough. I still love it undone. I think yeah, it's awesome. There's my cami. You've got to wear it a bit lower so you've got a bit of booty showing. I actually do like it undone. I really do like it undone. But I think doing it up is a yeah, very fashion is, forward this, look. Yeah, it's a fashion forward look. I'm yeah. going to be fashion forward because I'm a fashion designer. I'll just go. Move up. And I rather so like the loosening of that front seam, by the way. So I don't iron it out. I think that adds to the whole look, that kind of little bit of gathered seam down the front. It's very pretty. The whole thing's very pretty. So that's my look today. Totally. Let's talk about your look. And I'm wearing, I think it's called the Rosette or Rosetta. I actually can't Rosetta. remember. Rosetta. We think it's Rosetta. Yeah. And I absolutely... Hi, Mr. French. Hi, Mr. French. Rob, Robert is, is my father. He's yeah. not one of those 
funny goals. He's not a weird one. Well, maybe he's a little bit weird. Robert, what do you think you're funny, but don't tell anyone. No, no, we're not. Actually, Robert once said to me when I saw him, he said, can you actually sing when I come on? I'm like, yes. Yes. He just thought he was doing the sneaky. He thought he was just sneaking too. Yeah, that's right. You can't sneak around here. We see everything. So I'm wearing the Rosetta, and it's really stretchy, actually. Now that I've... Because I'm a huge fan of the Cisco Blazer, and this is like a version of... Um, a side sleeve detail in the fabric, but Love now that I've gotten into really stretchy kind of blazers, yeah, I'm, not sure, else, right? I'm not sure that I can go back, because I'm a real blazer girl, I love a blazer and jean, like that is my go-to outfit every time. That is a look. And now I'm like, now that I've been wearing this, I'm like, I don't know if I can wear all my other blazers that don't have stretch, this is so, just so happy. You can only go motto blazers from now on, right? Especially like when I'm picking up the baby, oh. I'm moving around, I have not taken this off all day, I've been at my desk, I've been up and about, I've been organising the racks, like I've been doing all this stuff, and I'm just so comfy. And then underneath I've got the Rodeo blouse, which is a bit longer at the back, I've, I've got, got it just front well. tucked, you don't have to, this is it not tucked, but for me, being short, I actually really like to wear a bit of wasted things because I feel like it makes my legs look a bit longer. So that's my... Yeah, and Same I actually thing. like how it's kind of wrapping... I've got to get this right. It's kind of wrapping my thighs around and I just feel very, very like flattered. I feel like I've, I've got a flattering look and I love all the sharp angles. Yes, when the blouse comes out, we've talked about this before, when it comes around the sides to the front, it kind of swings that part down. That's what you're talking about, love, isn't it? Yes, yeah, it's a bit more exaggerated, but same thing. Yeah, Somebody yeah, said absolutely. something about shoes, and just to let you know, we accidentally came in the same shoes today. They well, it's not me. something we're selling. No, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wear these all the time. Did you know, I guess I thought it would be safe to wear them today, but uh, you I was going to say, I was going to not wear them, and I tried on a few things, and I just felt like this outfit really needed these shoes. And I love mm. a bit of the yellow. It's got like a hint of yellow in the animal print. With okay, pink, show off our they, shoes. They Can have I the same this? idea. Yeah, there we be a balancing God. Oh, come on. What do you mean? There we go. There we go. That's right. Yeah. Okay, oh, let's, let's start. Let's start. Let's start. Yeah, let's start. Let's start. Okay. No, you're not. But I mean, it's like a little, little heel. Oh, no, no, that's okay. Yeah. There was something else we were going to say. Never mind. I guess we've lost it. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm wearing a size 8 in both these garments. And you're wearing? I don't even know. Probably 10s. Let me see. Let me see. Everyone wants to know, right? Of course you do. Yep, 10s. Ten, definitely a 10 in this, but actually the jeans, the jeans are an 8. Okay. Now we've only got our jeans left in an 8 and a 10. If you are an 8 or a 10, or maybe you're between a 10 and a 12 and you don't mind them tight, get them because they are the best jeans you will ever own in your entire life. That's all I'm going to say. So man wants me to my yoga moves. Maybe by the end of it. What <laughs> <laughs> other pose can I think of? Oh my god. Oh, can but... Faye untuck her blouse? Untuck? Sure. So everyone can see how long it is. You know what, this blouse is particularly perfect. This covers my camel toe, sorry Robert. Yeah, but it comes I'm way a, down. I don't think it's going to cover everyone's camel toe. I was just about to say, because I'm five foot. Yeah. If you're taller, it will probably come up to about, Yeah. my guess is, it, it's usually about three yeah. inches shorter. Yeah, about there. I think so exactly, they're just, exactly where it would come. Yeah, that, so it's just above your, your, camel your bits. Toe. Yeah, your bits. <laughs> your bits. <laughs> Now yeah, we're up to bits. Thanks, Samantha. Is that what you call them? Oh, no, you call them something else. Yeah, you call them something funny. Um, yeah, it was funny. So I'll do that up again just because I feel definitely. Taller. But the, the beauty of this blouse, it actually, we designed it to go with our, um, uh, you know, loose, loose cropped pants, which are coming, and our skirts. You'll find this length, we have to have some short lengths for skirts because they're fabulous. And we'll talk about that when the skirts come. In the future, come. when the skirts yeah. come. But for now, this is what we're doing. And fabulous is a tuck in for pant. 100%. And yes, Samantha, totally the hoo-ha. The hoo-ha, that's it. I the hoo-ha. Hoo 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 yes, hoo-ha's good. Okay, so we're going to go. show you. Now, number one, I feel like now we need... Should we not start with the jogger? Because the jogger was going to be the second one we talked about. Yeah, we're starting with the zippy. Okay. We'll start with the zippy. I just thought because you announced. Oh, because I've already announced. It doesn't matter. Well, we'll start with the zippy. Let's well, go from one, prefer... one end to the other. Otherwise, it's just going to mess us right up. Yeah, I prefer the jogger to the zippy because um, because this looks more trendy for me. And I kind of got to have an edge, yeah? Okay. But the zippy is really good for I didn't mean like that. I, I meant like no, 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 I know. You're just, just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah. Totally. I'm just saying that there's yeah, yeah. a reason why okay. I didn't pick the zippy. Uh, oh, to, to wear. To wear. wear. I'm okay. talking about to yeah. wear. I'm talking about to okay. wear now. Okay. I'd wear okay. it any other gotcha. day. Gotcha. I've got plenty of the zippies. So, the zippy pant. Let's okay. show it off. Let's show it off. Yay. This is the, the very basic Ben zippy. We call it Ben zippy because the Ben way. has the wide waist, so good for the ladies who like the wide waist. That tells you it's a very slim fit. And it has the zip bottom. 
which I actually think are fabulous because you, if you're tall, it'll be about this length on you. If you're a shorty like me, you unzip it and wear it over your shoes. Can I put a shoe there? I don't need to. You, you get the message. You, you get the shoes there and it just goes over your shoe. Absolutely. So there we go. So but where it would normally sit, if your average height and rarely have to take your pants up, it'll probably sit roughly where me and Faye's pants are sitting. That's about the length that they're designed to be. That's but right. they still look great longer. So you can and always have some months in previous length. Yeah, we all made them a bit shorter. A bit shorter, yeah. Shorter. If you want to look at our models on the website, they're, if, when they're wearing them, they're six foot, so you can get kind of an idea of to wear one extreme to the other. Um, so this pant in particular, okay, the features of this pant we're going to tell you, and then you can figure it out. John yeah. in. With all the information we've given you, you can work it out. They so, are our tightest leg. So if you want your legs held in a bit, no jiggly bits. No this, jiggly this bits. Is good. And it really, it's probably as tight as my jeans. So you can see it's hugging in my knee, hugging around my calf, and then it's coming in the side of there. See how it's really going in there and in there? It's That's completely, what this does. it's touching my entire leg except for the very, very bottom of the ankle. So that's what our zippy pants gonna do. You've got your tightest leg. Doesn't mean you have to go up a size, it's just designed to fit to your leg exactly. So now what body shapes are going to suit this? On, at a glance, is this a better, go up the screen and see if this is better for the pants. Well, we've got to see it here. Oh, okay, it still looks black. Yeah, yeah, you guys can see it. No, look, I can see okay. it. Okay, yeah. right. well, it just looks black. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. All right, so in particular, the people that may want to go for this pant as a guide in terms of your body shape, it's probably your apples, your strawberries, and, and column. spectrum. And column. And column. Yeah. Maybe, well, actually, maybe an hourglass, hourglass as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Even yeah. the main ones. Probably not a pair so much because it might just rip, it might, it would be a muffin top for sure. Mm. Don't you think? Yeah. Okay. You can work it, by the way. So if you're a pair, there are ways to work it. But in general terms, it's the apple end of the spectrum. Normally, you ladies, you want to show off your hot legs. So this yeah. pant being tight is really going to do that. I guess the way to look at it is if you if you think your legs are one of your hot features, this is the pant for you. Absolutely. Forget your shape for a moment. If you yeah. think that your legs are hot, go for it. Absolutely. Okay? That's what you do. Absolutely. So now we've got some. This is this is one where you probably want to hide the hoo ha, the camel toe, the the bits, whatever you want to call them. But I feel like... I love all these names, yeah. by the way. I mean, Try yeah, a few more if you've got them. Yeah, totally. You could technically, you can do a front tuck right, but I think this pant in particular really suits a side tuck. Because it's so tight, yes. a lot of ladies are a bit conscious about showing this area. I don't care, as you can tell, but, you know, okay, each to their own. I'll just let you know, I'm wearing the jogger. Yeah. The jogger. We've gone through that, it's a little bit more on the loose side. We'll go through that after this anyway. We'll go over it again. So this is your tightest fit. Now yeah. we've got pulled out some pieces just to show you the kind of things you're going to wear with a pant like this because you want to A, make sure it's good for your body shape and look in general, they actually do suit everyone's body shape. It's yeah. probably more yeah. about your Don't personal get, preference. No, I was going to say, really, we talk in terms of body shape and we have been just to give us something to talk about but really, all our garments are designed for all shapes. Mm -hmm. It depends on how you put it together. How you put it together, 100%. So just because you're a pear shape and I said this is it your best pant. Mm -hmm. Forget I said that because it can be your best pant Absolutely. Really, depending on how you put it together. Put it okay? together that's Please right. understand we design nearly everything for everybody. Very few things don't mix, you know. Uh, so I'll put that bit. Yeah, it has to be like that, right? Because we're going to be a business. Otherwise we're yeah, not going to sell otherwise that. we're not going to sell yeah. it. That's right. Okay, okay, so these are some outfits that if we could say like this is the pant made for this dress. Then we're, we're going to show you what we really think is just so perfect. So if you like this pant, then maybe you want to consider some of these pieces. That's right, yeah. And it just means it's a nice put together wardrobe. And we love it with our Bella dress. There'll be versions of this dress coming through too later, by the way. I think sleeveless and so on. So, so don't panic if you don't want a sleeve dress just yet. This is awesome. And I think we'll put in some shoes, shall we? What about those super slides? Am I going to go crazy? Yes, can you hold, hold you James? Hold, okay, I'll hold James. I'll get the slides. Oh, look what we found in the cupboard. Oh my God. Silver slides. We, we, we remembered that we had a cupboard full of shoes. Well, summer shoes. <laughs> and then like, I said, we've got so many boots here. We, we can't be showing them. We've got to go do some shopping. And then I said, hey, what? She I just pulled out the cupboard. cupboard. And I was like, oh. You know, I'm a shoe queen. They've got to be somewhere in here. Yeah. They've okay. got shoes stashed everywhere. Don't worry about that. Our shoes, the model <laughs> shoes, Jane's <laughs> shoes. You know, this is really good exercise by the way. I love take over. No, no, it's okay. I love doing these exercises. I, I mean, to... I'm okay, sorry, I'm... but this outfit, let it's me tell awesome. you. It's awesome. Something about... 
about yellow and black. I've got to get an extra in, guys. It's so in. And these shoes, if you want a pair of metallic slides, that's all you have to do. The metallic slides, they'll come up with every colour, and any metallic colour is going to match because they're neutral, right? So you can wear your pop of colour, whether they were gold, silver, yeah. rose gold, copper, it doesn't matter because it's going to match. Silver necklace, silver shoes, what sort of silver is there? Really cute. I love that. By the way, I just want to say something about necklaces or about jewellery. This might not be the right time where I will say, yeah, oh, don't waste our time with it. But you know what? Jewellery, well, you might not, darling. You might not. You might say, look, we've got a major thought of it. <laughs> not likely. It's going to say, you're wasting She's our time like, again. Yeah, you're yeah, yeah, making an announcement for half an hour. Anyway, jewellery is something that can really date you. So just yes. because you've got that strand of pearls that you bought 20 years ago and you can save in it, Please don't throw it on all your trendy gear because it brings no. the whole thing down. Um, We've got to keep it trendy. Yeah, and agree. this is why we do, well, it is called junk jewellery. We're not, you know, we're not specialists in jewellery. We just design jewellery that's for the moment. Um, and this is for the moment. These chunky chains are just really cool with the Absolutely. outfit. And you'll see us throwing them in quite a bit. Okay. This outfit is we'll have more cool. later. This is like if I was going to quickly place this outfit somewhere, this is like your very stylized Mornington lady because we've got a bunch of stores everywhere. Mornington lady, and sometimes okay. I can, we can spot these. There's just a way people dress in certain areas. Don't you think this is your Mornington well, lady? Well, can I just say it's definitely not LA. It's definitely, definitely not LA. So you see what we mean? It's Mornington. No. I can see Mornington. It's definitely wearing Mornington. A hundred percent. True, if you're watching, you're from Mornington. Yes. Have a look at this outfit. It's for you, darling. Yeah, Terry's watching. Terry's the manager yeah, of Mornington. Yeah, she's going to have to bring everyone to Mornington. Yeah. I can see so many Mornington <laughs> customers wearing this, and they would look fantastic, right? Oh, okay, great. Right. So there's. So I'm going to take Jane's pants off. Yep. We'll find another thing for Jane. All right. Don't go over how many ways you can wear that because the other that thing you can do. Dress comes in a bunch of colours too. If you haven't seen us talking about it non-stop before it also comes in a pink and a black is the coin removed no no the coin's not removed you know what i have to move you know what you can certainly yes. take it off it's only a tiny little ring and just remove it i've done that with a few of mine mm. when i want to change because you know i take a lot of value out of everything and chop and change it so this is also really good for these big loose tops Definitely. now that's a trend in itself you know how we're always in big loose tops well i don't know if you do know but we'll just say that uh this is a perfect look this top also comes in green, and I believe there might be a few pale pinks left, not many. So yeah, if yellow is not your colour, then there's other options as well. You can have a look. Yeah, I love that. I love and the black. I love it with the slides. Love it with the slides. Yeah, absolutely. Silver slides or anything. Yeah, anything that's um, a bit metallic. I think is a really good choice. Hundred percent. Actually, this season. One thing I will say: this top is particularly suited again to anyone who really wants to hide, or you're a little bit conscious of your tummy mm. area, yes, or your muffin all. top area, or your. Even if you've got really big boobs, this top looks fantastic because you want to show off those slim legs with a tight pant. But I must say, that Bella dress we had before, if you're a pear shape, that's how you can wear this dress. You put a dress on, it's actually, you put something on that's sort of tight on your shoulders and your arms, that's how you can make this pant work. So again, yes, that's right. you know what I mean? There's always a way to wear it. Yeah. And I'll also say, look, I don't really have a lot of big stuff on my body and I still love this. I like love it. It is a hot no, item. Yeah. yeah, it's not about hiding. It's just about enhancing what's under there. So if anybody wears this, you could be any shape under it. Oh, absolutely. And that's what's so cool about absolutely. it. Absolutely. Yeah. But in general, not always, in general, a pair of tight pants looks great. Although I've worn mine with a baggy pair of pants and do a front tuck and that looks that's awesome right. too. You can also do a front knot in this. Shall we do a front yeah. knot? Yep, you knot Jane. Oh, I'm not Jane. Which side is it? This side. I go for the shorter side, maybe not, I'll go for the longer side. Because if we're trying to make it a little bit shorter, you go for the longer side, put a knot in it, and it just brings it up. Now, and again, if you wanted to be adding a bit of length to this, you know you just have to wear your blogger shirt or something along those lines underneath. That'll cover the camel toe. Then you've got your top that's poking out, so you've got those three layers. So you can okay. always do just that too. Just answering Gail here, she's wanting to know which pant to go for. She thinks she has chubby legs. You probably don't have chubby legs, but if you if you find that that's what happens when you buy clothing, uh, then you probably need our gen, which we're coming up to later. So look out for that. But but really, you could also go the jogger. You'd be so easy. Well, the pants. jogger is this, yeah. so probably not this pant because you yes. might find a bit too grippy on yes. your leg. Unless you go up a size. If you went up to a 16, if you said you're between 14 and 16, you could still do this pant really easily. Totally. It's a little stretch. Yeah. I mean, that's the added advantage of buying anything motto. You have that leeway. 
you know, and it and it stretches between sizes. Yeah, and actually Gail's also mentioning that she's five foot, so she's similar height to Faye. The best thing about this fabric is that it's really easy, and we'll show you later on, how to cuff it for your height. So the zippy I've, pant... I've done that, haven't I? Yeah, you have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we can show you as we go on. We oh, can actually okay. get a pant off the rack maybe and go close up. But it's yes. easy. I mean, we all know how to cuff a pant, right? Faye has a great little trick. But the zippy pant is probably a little bit more tricky to alter the length. So, um, but nowadays, I think if you want to shush up your outfit, you need these extra things that we're telling you. So don't worry about making them precise. That's not a look. No, no absolutely. You, know, you want to be like the French girls and just have it not quite right. 100%. Because that's what makes it stylish. 100%. So, so this. you can always, just quickly, do we have a... We don't have the right colour, but if you wanted to add something like our blogger shirt, any of them, not to under this. underneath that, you can actually add some length. We don't have a lot of blogger shirts to show you because... You've bought them oh, all. Okay, so let's. Okay, what am I doing? You can't quite see it, but it is under there. It is yeah. under there. We can just quickly put it under. This um, colour isn't yeah. quite right, but we actually have some more bloggers coming, guys. I think that yellow and white really interesting. Yeah, there we go. So, so if you wanted to do that, length. if you want to cover the, you know what? There you are. Simple, right? And you can always do the knot to make it shorter. So you're getting this. You're getting extra style by doing something like this. Yeah, totally. rather than just a normal everyday. Basic. Standard basic. We don't want to look basic. That let me tell doesn't you. Doesn't make you fashionista, right? Um, Samantha's just asking, will our locations be staying where they are? Yes, they are. Samantha, definitely. Yes, yeah, they are. We're not moving anytime soon. Not moving anytime soon. We're bound by leases. Yeah, so we're definitely not <laughs> so moving we're definitely anytime soon. Going anywhere. <laughs> um, but I, I will mention, and we're going to talk about this more when our shops open. Please don't be disappointed when the shop's open. They are not going to have all the stock that we're showing. It, we can't. We can't. It's not possible to put all our styles in the stores because now, um, I suppose, we're showing you our lives. We're actually designing products for our lives. We can't physically fit every single item that we're designing in our stores. They do have a capacity of how many units we can put in. So online, we'll showcase the entire motto range, and each motto store will have a selection of the motto range. So. I'm just saying in advance, don't be upset, that's just how it is. And it's awesome because we get to design as much as we want and we're not bound by size. We can just design away! Yeah, designing away. Somebody mentioned, I've, the comments already gone so I can't see the name, about they're liking these but they don't like the low waist. They're not low waist, they're coming up to my belly button. So, yeah, and that'll be the case for all of you. It won't be, mm. like I think it's at the most one finger below your belly button. It's about don't that, yes, one, absolutely. One and that's yeah. the comfort. We don't like it right up here on the waist because it digs in and then you get a bit of a pot, whereas this kind of comes just a little bit lower so that it holds you in. And actually, yeah. I find in particular that waistband of the jogger, only because I wore it yesterday, I'm, I feel like I can say this with confidence, it's very comfortable because of the elastic. It's a very oh, soft, soft extremely elastic, really yeah. soft. It's not, so it doesn't dig and it doesn't cut in and it, didn't, it doesn't roll. You know how some elastics can do that? Super comfortable. Yeah, I found the same because it is meant to be just a bit on the looser, more relaxed actually, side. Actually, this one we measured before, before we go on to this, it is actually, uh, this one is actually an inch, 2.5 centimetres higher than the other pants we have. So, I don't know why you think it's low, it's not low. Mm. Mm. No, okay, it's not low. just it's not like super high like though. Mm. Yeah, well, nothing we have is super high, really. Oh, so, so I've just tried mine and the waistband is rolling. So Joanne, I, when I wore mine yesterday, yeah, my waistband it? didn't roll at all. Yes, I wonder if it could be a size thing. Yeah, that's yeah. bizarre. Okay, all right. Definitely didn't roll for me, but yeah, you know what? Well, maybe it depends where it exactly falls on your body then, maybe. This yeah. problem they're called the jogger. Yeah, you can't help you, Joanne. Disappointing. Yeah, yeah. Um, I definitely didn't find that problem yesterday. And I do I get that. Tight. Yeah, maybe they're too tight. I, did, I do get that on pants, though, the waistband rolling. Yeah, but often. if it's on the jogger, I didn't actually get it. Okay, anyway, let's keep moving. Yeah, we'll move on. All right. Yeah, Bromlin, they're called the jogger. So the only one we've got now is the black jogger, which is what Faye's wearing. The white one is completely sold out. Okay, cool. Okay, so we're still going on, on here? Yeah. So uh, we think the zippy, being a tight pant, is best worn with longer garments. So if you like that tunic, look, this is the pant for you. And this is just showing you another version of it. I think as well, these zippy pants are really good if you almost want that option to... It's like you like the legging look. But you don't want to wear leggings. You want to wear something better than a legging. So I think that this pan is particularly good if you are the, if you really liked that look and a lot of your clothes work, you know, they cover the crotch, they're a bit longer, and you really like that tight leg. This is the pan for you. Yes, with the two long tunics. 
And at the same time, now we're doing something with this. What are we doing with this? Look at eight and nine. No, is that meant this to be is there? Just, I don't know. This is just a front tuck. If you want to do a front yeah. tuck, I guess. Or a so side tuck, maybe. Or even a side tuck. Yeah. It's a little bit on the short side, so if you I know, I, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
yes. with our fabrics and colours and patterns and so yeah, on. Definitely. Now we're up to the jogger, yeah. which I'm wearing. I think okay. everyone wants to know so about the jogger. So the jogger is the in between fit. Oh, Sharon sure. wants to know what this is called. It's called the the Benny Moto Jacket or Moto Jacket. M O Moto Jacket for Moto. Shall I put on for you? Yeah, sure. That not Smith. Sharon. Sharon asks. Yeah, Sharon. I will do that. The metallic shoes. They're really old. Um, they're oh, from man. ASOS. They're, and, uh, oh, they're like look, years You old. know what my trick is with shoes, ladies. At the end of every season, I fossick through everybody's brand from overseas as far as shoes go. I don't do it with clothing because I reckon their clothing is really bad on sale in general. Mm. I think I wouldn't buy anything else motto anyway. But mm. for shoes. You might be just lucky and get size. something in yes. your size. Yep. Now, often you can't get your size, so it does take a lot of time to scroll through copious pages of different shoes, mm. but you can get the right shoe. But you have to know what the trend is, and we're giving you the trend. Yeah, that's right. So then follow that and, and get the good shoe. It doesn't even have to be marked down. If you want to spend money on it, go for it. But mm. really, you don't have to, especially no. if it's a fashion piece that you may um, not be you know, sure of. Not be sure of. Absolutely. And, yeah, and you don't know. And, and we're trying to show you shoes that are actually very easy to Google. We're trying to avoid the really, like shoes like I'm wearing, we'll, we're going to get that. Get you know, wear. But I think with that, you could just Google, you know, silver metallic slide, pointy slide, and you'll find plenty of similar. That looks good. Looks good. It yeah. actually looks quite nice with this. I mean, yeah. It actually looks rather good with this mix of pretty and... Yeah, definitely. Not and with these shoes, edgy. ladies, but it gives yeah. it a... Yeah, totally. I, I do my, my big boots. By the way, the jacket's a bit big for me too, so... Yeah, definitely. But I, I think I love that jacket most with the yellow dress. Oh, it is a yellow dress, so it's a bit big for me. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, it needs to be the yellow dress. Yeah. Okay, great. Okay, so now we're moving... We've got our jogger, right? So Faye's wearing it. This is the next fit up from the zippy pad. So you slide the top. Bigger. That's right. Bigger leg. Yes. More comfy leg. Uh, just a bigger leg. It's more relaxed, more casual. And you know what? The pant... This pant, I'm going to show you... Maybe I'll show you on this because I can't pick Faye up and... No, <laughs> don't try it. Whatever you do, don't <laughs> try it. Now you can see, okay, so then we've got our pockets here with a bit of stitching detail. Then we've got this seam all the way down there. Now it's not so obvious, but that actually acts to completely slim your thigh. It's all about the flattering yeah, you can see aspect the here at Motto. Looks really good. So there you can see. Now this is that waistband that I was telling you about, which I find incredibly comfortable, but obviously we're all a little bit different. So it's sort of like, I feel like this is your solution to wearing your black, favourite black skinny jeans. It kind of has that element of grunge to it, a black jean. It's like a bit edgy. This is that pant. Well, this is like the most comfortable pair of jeans you've ever bought, mm. isn't it? I'm, I'm finding that because they're, they're a jean and they're fantastic over here in their stretch. But this is super duper comfortable. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I know. But it's, it's got that element of being jeansy in a way. Jeansy. It's sort of got that casual yeah, vibe, yeah. etc. Better than your tracksuit pants. Mm. Better, better than a lot of those jogger type things. Mm. So it's a very smart jogger. Yes, and yes. It takes exactly. the place of a jean, but yeah. a classier jean. Yes, so that's yes. Totally. Kind of getting to yes, the that's spot. right. Yeah. Mm. And the, the the that seam over the thigh. I mean, who doesn't want? A longer looking thigh, if you ask me, being short, we all do. Okay, so. Oh, Cheryl, I understand what you're saying about you've got to try shoes on. But you know what? I have been buying shoes online. I don't think I've bought any shoes oh, other than when we go, go traveling, but I'm buying, buying everything online and I just adjust with inner soles, really. Yeah, I always size up if I'm not sure. You need sure, that yeah. comfort under your feet and then you can't go wrong. Getting the exact size, although when you're an open shoe, you probably need the exact size. You have to take a guess, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. No, I find as anyway, well. I always go half a size up if I'm like, mm, and then I do a gel I'll, pad. I will show you. Look what I've done to these shoes. Now, Lauren, you don't I was have wondering that. what that was. What's your shoe like? No, my shoe's not like that. See, I was looking at Faye's shoes before. See, Mine's just black. Because I bought a fancy insole and put that in because I've got to make sure it's comfortable. You see, it's all padded all the way down there. there yeah, absolutely. So, okay. Wendy, um, Faye's wearing a size 8 in these pants, so you can kind of see how yes. they're a little bit baggier. Yes, so they're a little bit baggier. I'm assuming you can see all the... Because sideways, you, you can see there's excess there. There's mm. not... Uh, it's not gripping my leg. Mm. Karen, um, for shorties, the slide's a bit too flat. 
They don't have to be, and you can get any size. You can get some with a wedge. You can get a platform that's still completely flat, but there'll be a big platform on the bottom. Look, I wear them all the time. I'm yeah. five foot two. I've got no problem. They, I like a wedge. Like something with yeah. a bit of height. That's. I suppose that's probably personal choice. Okay, Lynn Innersoles. I wherever I can, basically. I Do get you have them from the supermarket or chemist warehouse, supermarket, uh, shoe shops. Um, often shoe places sell Innersoles. And I just get a, an array of all different types and I test them all out. Um, you know, party feet, you name it. Sometimes I use party feet and something like this which sticks all the way along. But I've bought a roll of dumb cyber tape, a thick variety. I don't know what it's called. It's probably, uh, is it SM? The, the brand for? Uh, um, 3M. 3M. 3M, yeah, thank you, 3M. Um, I was thinking of SM, no, I wasn't. <laughs> I wasn't. Um, and I stick that right. in the middle of my shoes. And, yeah. That's all right, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm your mother. Do you mind? Okay, so you just mind? scrap that. We want to cut that out normally, but I can't. So I stick all my inner soles, and you know what? It's going to cost me $10 extra for every pair of shoes. It is so worth it. And Faye finds it hard to find shoes in her size. Because I'm so that's why she was forced into this, right? Yeah, she I was forced into Because I'm actually a size. I used to be a four and a half. Can you believe it? Look at my little foot. We have a look at that. <laughs> Four and a half. So you can wear kids' shoes. You can buy the team. I can. I can wear kids' shoes, shoes, but then kids' shoes they're are much cheaper. cool. Yeah, yeah, they're not as cool. Um, so I do have trouble getting my size. And this is why I know this trick. You know, so like all your hardships end up really being good for you. Yeah. And I can buy size six. I want to the soles in there. Okay. So is the check in the jacket the same as the check fabric in the zippy pant? Yes. 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 It is. You can totally. make them a set if you like. Really out there. You'll be out there. You'll be out there, sure. but you do you. You do it. Yeah, you do it the way you want to do it. Girl. Okay. All right. So are the so pants all the same weight fabric? Yes. These black pants in particular, oh, all the same fabric. weight, all the same fabric. That's Other right. pants might be different, but these particular black pants are exactly the same. So we sort of touched on that at the start. Mm -hmm. Very breathable, very light, perfect for Gorgeous. summer, perfect for Gorgeous stuff. Yeah. Okay, so we've got the jogger. Now we're going to show you some outfits to do with the jogger. So I think actually the jogger, probably reflective of how well the light sold because it went in about a day. Um, hours. I think the jogger is almost throws itself to any, really to any yes. body shape. Yeah. Yeah, because it's it in does. between, right? Yeah, look, you can be a bigger legged lady than what we are, just fill them out more and have a slightly different look. But actually do the same thing, don't you think? Absolutely. So if you want to like show off your booty, this would be great. If you've got great legs, this would be great. It's kind of that in between, you can it's throw it either, either way. Mm. And I think the main thing about this and why I would recommend it is it's a little bit edgy. So if you want something that's a bit cool factor, this is what you're going to go. Whereas the pant we're going to show you next, I would think is more your classic person. I've got, I've got to say, sorry, I've got to interrupt. I've got to say something to Joanne. You are one of the lucky ones, just like me. It's usually the outer edges that get left in shoes, so that's where you get the bargains. Yeah. You just got to make sure they go up to size 10. I'd be going for it, girl. Yeah. Going to the sale, um, like ASOS and the Iconic. That have a lot of shoes. They have yeah. like, I don't know, 1,700 shoes or something. Yeah. And I'll bet there'll be a lot in your size and left often, over for a bargain. Often as well, you can actually filter by size. So you might that's want to right. filter by size 10 and size 10 and a half then everything in those sizes is going to come up. We've got the same thing on our website. So when things are bitsy on sale, you want to just find your size. Who cares about and that's the rest? Because I buy them for online and I need to get size 10 or 14 or 41 for the models. And then, of course, while I look, I might as well look for myself. <laughs> Nothing in size 5, but often size 6. So I get bargains at both ends. And there's nothing in between. They're all sold out. Yeah, so all the size sevens and eights, sorry. Yeah, sorry. We're, we're going to spend money. Yeah, 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 we're going to spend money. Okay, okay so, so we'll you know, show you some dressing? outfits. Um, go the dressing first? Work. So Definitely. I guess we, we've already shown my dressing wool outfit. Love this blouse, by the way. Look, I want to talk a little bit more about the blouse, even though it's about the pant. It's that beautiful Victorian look without having all that tears, ladies. Mm. It's, it's still got a lot of sex appeal, I think. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that... I'm, I know what you're all thinking. I'm totally vibing oh, okay. with you all. You're saying, but I've got big boobs. Oh, okay. It won't look good on me. No, but look. someone's got really big fake boobs. Look at I'm that. sorry to say they're, they're fake, but they they're are. You they're know, real. And well, then it looks awesome on her. To give you an example, my front half is a size 10 and my back half is a size 6. That must mean my boobs are on the big side, yeah? Mm. Yeah, okay. So that's exactly. that blouse. So it does look good if you've got bigger boobs. Yeah, Faye's got it done up. 
Um, really well nice. Personal preference though, can you do it undone again just to show everybody what it looks yeah, like? Yeah, I've got what to say. Because it looks amazing undone. I'd be like, no, no, I can't do it done up, you know, I like a bit of a V, um, and I want to show it differently, blah, blah. As soon as I did it up, I just did not do it anymore. Mm. Although, it has a real fashion factor. I mean, I've got to say, I do that. It is pretty nice. There you go. It's pretty nice that's, like that too, yeah. Oh, actually, that's quite nice too. Mm. But today, I'm going to do this. Yeah. So Cheryl's got this shirt too, and she's saying she's been busted. It looks lovely on you. Yes, of course. It does. I just thought maybe some people were thinking, I've so, got big boobs, and I don't want the round yeah. neck. No, it looks lovely. I'm sure it looks lovely on you, Cheryl. Post it, please. Let the ladies yeah. know. Cheryl's and very funny. Floor, floor to your, your boobies, you know. Go, look, I'm big busted. Look what I'm wearing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say face there. Just in case you don't want to do that. <laughs> that face that I had to do this. <laughs> uh, so it doesn't button all the way down. It's just that one top button and then you get that little V-neck. Um, I think our website actually shows it unbuttoned. Unbuttoned, but I'm going to do some new shots with it buttoned up because I think it looks so sexy like yeah. this now. And I think the good thing about that is that's the shirt that is going to take you into next winter because perhaps when it's cold, yes. you're going to want to do it up and you can wear a long sleeve top under that and, be, and no one will even know. Yeah, you're, you're thinking of function. I was, I was thinking it's going to take you into winter because it's a trendy look. Oh, well, that too. Yeah, that too. Okay. I'm more, <laughs> I'm, I'm more a bit more functional. Yeah, okay, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Obviously. Yeah. But then I'm thinking in summer you want to have it open and have it a bit bit more boho, a bit exposed. So it kind of throws two looks. That's what I like about yeah. it. I guess you really want to see it down too. I didn't think of that. You want to have a look at it down? Why not? Okay. Got to do both sides. It's pretty amazing. It's actually it's really sexy. Amazing. I yeah. did that with my, um, when they come in, the, the silky sh uh, skirts. It look awesome. Like so this. nice. And I was really thinking beautiful. even with a cargo, even yeah, with like a, a leather look pant mm. or something, you want to go so opposite. You yes. want to go that really like um, leather feminine, skirt. gorgeous, leather yeah, skirt. and then get really cargo. edgy down below, totally. I mean, I would love it with a pair of like, you know, fairly distressed jeans, Ooh, like even a bit baggy jeans. jeans. Drop, yeah, totally. I would wear it with my drop crutch leather pants. There you go, or leather red pants. Yeah. That would look really good yep, yep, yep. Okay, so we've got this look happening. Now let's move on. So this is kind of our Dina blouse, is it? No, this is the Bondi. Oh, the Bondi, which is fabulous because it's taking the place of a, a um, caftan. Gorgeous look. Love it with this. I'd still do a front tuck or even a side tuck. You said, 100%. Now, I think what you're saying, you can certainly. I think almost you should do a front tuck with this pan. I'm not. Yeah, I, I think yeah, it means it's like you need a front because, tuck. Because, look, your bits and all that look pretty good, don't they? Yeah, it's not like yeah, so tight. Like it's not like anywhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. For most of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, oh, Lynn just wants you to spread your arms out just so you that she can see the top. Okay. Not mine? Yeah. And what did I say? This was an 8 or a 10? It's quite sizeless, a 10. Oh, a 10. Okay, yeah. this is a 10. So it's quite... Don't worry, you can, you can fit a lot in there and still look pretty good, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Uh, it's, it's just the proportion of it. If you've got the bigger boobs, obviously this is going to come up more. That's when you need to do the front tuck because if it's going to be like up there because your boobs are filled it out, mm -hmm. you may not like it. You might feel a little bit weird, mm -hmm. but that's okay. Mm -hmm. Just make sure you do the front tuck, you know? Um, Sue, yes, it is the same pink as the cami, the cow cami. It's exactly the same pink, well, same yes, fabric. And then would beige shirt work with the cargo pants? Oh, yeah. Yeah, 100%. I think in fact, really I should cool. wear it with my khaki cargo. Yeah, it's super awesome cool. if you've got the khaki. Definitely, Definitely the black because it goes beautifully yeah, with black. Yeah, for sure. I think that's a great look. Great look. Okay, so back to this, um, the jogger. Okay. I think with the jogger, you want it, you know, because it's not tight, you kind of need to show some definition of body. And if you're going to wear a loose fitting top, I think you need to say, hey, my waist is here. So people can kind of work you out, you know. You don't want to look like a big sack. That's right. Well, that's actually the thing that makes anyone look fat is when they're trying to hide something. And that's why you've got to keep your style about you mm. because the minute you go a big sack look, you're hiding something to an observer and you look like you're Absolutely. Overweight. So um, who, who asked? Bron, when you asked what shirt this was, it's the um, Bondi. Yeah, the Bondi. Bondi shirt. One of our main shapes, actually. It's a beauty. And it also comes in this print for now. This is sheer. Another great thing is when you wear a sheer shirt, it's actually a very flattering way to very subtly show where your silhouette is under there. Um, but this, this fabric's also good because it really colours. Oh, it's because it's your shoulders. Like, yeah. see, this blouse is just a huge blouse, really. But yeah, it's just, just have it into your body. But in the yeah, right areas. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, fantastic. 
So you can certainly do a bit of a front tuck here. Yeah, Sharon, you can go up a size for sure. length. Great yeah. tip, Sharon. I think that's a really good point. Or wear a cami underneath it to get the length. You can yeah. do so many things for Definitely. length. Definitely. Now, with this one in particular, if anyone cares about me, I probably wouldn't go with a long shirt to cover your crutch in this. I'm just not so sure, unless it's really tight, I'm not so yeah. sure that's right. I think that's something you have to decide yourself. It's going to put weight on if you get a baggy pant with a baggy long. It's like trying to hide something. Yes. Else. So if you're trying to have a lot of volume up the top, you're better off with a skinny leg. Unless you're going to do a front tuck and show part of your body. Show just something. Like you know? Yeah, yeah. That's why I've been suggesting the front tuck with this pant. Great. Right. Now this top we showed you before in the yellow, and this is also an absolute winner with the jogger because you can do the front tuck. Oh, we've not bought out any shoes. What shoes do we think? Oh, okay. It's got a lot in the back. <laughs> <laughs> we're obviously playing in the knots in the back, no one can see that. That's great. I mean, if you're going to a barbecue or you're going somewhere that you need to be smart, casual, this is exactly the look that you want to do. I think I like the slides, the gold slides. Love yes. the gold slides. There we go. Absolutely. You've got to sneaker, but I think we're done. Oh, actually, um, actually, this is nice. Okay. I'll throw that sneaker in. That's a nice sneaker. Love like that. So again, you can knot this top like we showed you with the yellow, or you can just do a soft front tuck. I like it as Such a, a winner. Front tuck. Yeah. Such a winner. Just make it a little bit different. And, now this is almost gone. It's almost gone, but this was too good. So sorry. It was too good not to put in with these outfits we're about to show you. So if you've got it, well done, this is for you. And if you don't have it, just check if your size is there because I do know that it's selling very fast. Okay, you're asking if this is any bigger in the arms, that, uh, this is uh, Catherine, any bigger in the arms than other bloggers. Well, this is more like the everyday shirt. Yeah, it's more the everyday shirt. And what you've got to know about this is, don't do up the cuff. If, it, if the sleeve is a little bit tight, just don't do up the cuff so you've got that leeway of arm movement because that's a very trendy look to have the cuffs undone. But only if it's a bit short on you. If it's long on you and you have it undone, it's messy. But when it's up here, like if it was up here and the cuff's undone, very trendy. Yes, then you get a lot more room. And, well, we think it's bigger. Haven't actually measured it, but... Depends on it's still, it's, very it's, full. No, no, I would say it's it's about it's probably the blogger shirt is a very different sleeve. The blogger shirt has a sleeve from the shoulder, specifically long to, to the bottom of your arm. Whereas this, because oh, I can throw it on if you like. Throw it on. It actually it's a drop shoulder, so it comes down to about there, and the sleeve is just that part of your arm. So it's it's probably not. You probably couldn't say which one is bigger. Yeah, it's it's too hard to measure. It's too hard to measure. Okay, I've left my other shirt there. Like, okay, it looks it's too, too big for you. It looks on too most people, me. that sleeve is going to come up to about yeah, there. Yeah, that's what I mean. So yes. if it's up there and it's tight, just by leaving it undone is a bit of a funky look. Definitely. And it doesn't, it doesn't look bad. Look, if that's up there and it's undone, I reckon it looks cool. In fact, right. I had photographs done like that with the models because I thought it looked so funky. And you could even do your armbands. That's and right. And you could actually do your armband there. Right, leave it undone, put your armband on, and then and just blouse, blouse that over. over. My blouse. Yeah, yeah, it looks cool. Mm. I think that it's, it's cool. It's a cool look. Yeah, so you really have to zhuzh everything up. Like, I think we've got to go back to when we first started and we kept saying, when you buy something, especially online and you take it home, don't go around doing everything up because you're never going to wear it like that, you know? You've got to try it on like you're going to wear it. Like, if I was never going to do this blouse up, I would not go home, try it buttoned up, Unless I had intention of seeing it, I suppose. But you know, if I was going to just wear it undone, that's the way I brought myself in front of the mirror to know whether I like this thing or not. Mm, definitely. All right, so I'm just getting prepared this the the leaf uh, blogger shirt, the button for it. How amazing! How does it look with this green? So if you have the green top on top, you can see it peeping out the neckline, which you'll be able to see more when you've actually got it on. Jane doesn't have a neck. Then, if you wanted to, you could do the little knot. And then you're going to see it poking out the hem. And actually, I didn't get the sleeves out. Got me help? Might need your help. Sure. Then you can also get your cuff. Now, this actually would work with any of the pants we're showing you. Because if you wanted to do the tight pant, you'd leave the blogger shirt hanging loose for the crutch cover. But if you want to do the jogger, you could simply tuck the whole one half, half in. Yeah, the whole half, right. or just one half. That's nice, it's just had one half hanging out. There. So you've got these little peekaboo areas that really they say style. More style. That's right, they just say more style. Absolutely. All right, good. So if you've got this top, great, that's one look. But then if you don't want to do the top over a top, 
Then we could always, and this was such a good match, we couldn't not do it. We got excited. We do get excited sometimes. We get excited about most things. We're excited Why not? A bunch. Why not? Life's short, is that right? So you've got to get excited. We're always excited. If I can get this out. Tell the ladies are sharing where they're from. Great to see. Okay, so. That's so it. nice, isn't it? This is fabulous for an apple shape, by the way, if you're wondering. Really good. Because you've got your big, baggy, kind of swing cape top. It's showing off those shoulders. It's not fitted on the shoulders, but it's really showing where your shoulders are. And even show it undone with yeah, your nice. Really nice. Really nice. Yeah, Jane's messy. You know, she's a messy dresser. Jane's a mess. Yeah. Um, and then you could either do, in this situation, if you wanted to do it with your jogger, you could do a half tuck. Or you could do a little knot down here, which would also look quite nice. The green top called, okay. Jane's pants are too high. Oh, okay. This is the ripple happened. cowl over top. Ripple cowl over top. I'll fix you up, sorry. All right, you hold this. So if you wanted to, you could do a little knot on the green to then, so you can show a bit more of the jogger, because like we're saying, I don't think you want to have the jogger so covered. But if you wanted to wear it long, you could wear the zippy pant that we showed before, because it's going to cover the crutch area. Great. Okay. Okay. I don't want to spend too long on this shirt because it's almost gone. Yeah, that's right. Well, we're done with that shirt now. We're done. Okay, so now for the last, but not least, pant. Is that easy, easy Jean? This is the hard, the, the, uh, I was going to say the hardest. Well, it's the, the most generous fit here. Yeah? The generous fit. So it's an easy fit leg. That's right. And it's still, and it's, you know, it's well, like fitted on up to your mid-thigh, let's say. Then it kind of straightens off. So if you don't want that tapered look, if you don't want it to be tight from the knee down, this is the pant for you. Whereas Faye's aren't tight, but Faye's do still stay in line with her body shape. Now you can't really tell because she's got them cuffed so much because she's so little. But um, do you need no, to say something? No, that it doesn't come in the green with the frill at the back. I don't know at what the back, that back coming that does green. Does the jacket with, with the, the frill at the back? No, it doesn't come in that green. <laughs> what back? You know, the frill, the frill jacket. I'm oh, assuming yeah, it doesn't come no, in that colour. No. no, no, it's a different fabric. Mm. Um, yeah, great. So where was I? Yeah, if you don't want it to hug your ankle, this is probably the jean for you. And also, it's got a bit more length, so it's really full length. So if you are very tall... Six foot girls go for this pant. In particular. Now, if you if you want to lose a pant and you're not six foot tall, it doesn't matter. Because all we're going we're gonna to come up and show you how to do the cuff trick to make it look a bit more stylized. That's right. Let's go up here and do this. So it is a bit of a wider leg, but that's cool too. So pull it up to where you want your length, your end result length to be, and then halve the, the fabric over the top of it so it makes like a cuff. And what happens, it brings this in a little bit, you get a bit of ruching there like mine. I don't know if you can see that. And it just looks more funky. Mm. It looks more with it. Especially if you want to taper in the ankle, that's really good. But the other thing you could do, if you really don't want to taper in the ankle, you can actually just maybe, maybe hold, maybe hold it. Well, you can you can obviously cuff it up, but that will eventually taper in the ankle too. You know, you can oh, do, do it like, like that if you want to. Way, yes. But you could also just, you know, if you wanted to, you can just cuff it under. And you can even cuff it under twice. Oh, do you cuff it under twice? Well, it depends well. how short you are. <clears throat> so if you wanted to, you can just have a straight hem like that. Like if it is too long and you don't want it to be... A little bit tapered because if you're going on the outside because the bottom of the leg is a bit smaller than the main leg it'll just narrow it in a little bit just like how Faye's got on yes that's right no yeah I so it's quite trendy right? yeah it is. so so this is great for the people that are taller but it, do, it doesn't need to be you can easily make that alteration yourself and it'll stay up okay okay so we hold this you want to have a go at pulling some things out sure okay and this has got a very comfort Rise, it's quite high, and it's got the elastic around the waist, which is encased. So you can just and pull it on. And when it's on, it's flat. Yeah. But it's it's quite easy to pull on. Yeah, great. Okay, so now we've got our um, ripple flounce top. This top is so beautiful. I'm just going to quickly show you what it does on the arm without actually taking it. Yes, so my on. cup is just so much easier, isn't it? So there's a, tr a real trend of big sleeves, and we can do a live on that. Seat. Yes, we'll do that next time, maybe. So this is what this sleeve looks like, just to give you an idea. I think pop that under that jacket. You saw these jackets. You want to put it on, put it on the jacket first, yeah? Uh, yeah. I'll just dress. I suppose it's easier. I'll just dress Jane. Yeah. Just like the bit of a frill coming down the jacket. You can do this while it's not too 
too warm. Alright, hang on, just get organised. Yes, come down from Queensland. Yeah, I know, we're, we're stuck here, it's okay, we understand. Oh, Everybody's stuck, stuck everywhere. It's okay, we can connect this way, can't we? Totally. Yeah. How good is this combo, guys? We, we love it. Excited. We love it. And it looks fabulous with black. And this just brightens it up. Can we do, can we do the silver science? Oh, yes. Even the green shoes are good, right? Yes. Them both out. Yes, I will. How about that? Perfect. And I How good is that? I love them. I love the silver. They're so cute. I love it with that too. And you know How what? gorgeous. I don't know, but I'm thinking even of these. We're going to give these a bit of a fashion now. I'll put those back in here. I think if you want to go just that wee bit dressier, look at that when you're ready. For sure, and it'll be like really? this. Oh, okay. Yeah. Really dressy. Sort of like that. Fabulous. It kind of covers everything. And the one thing I love about this little combo is you'd actually pull your sleeve up and have these bits hanging out the bottom. So you want to really show off that shirt cuff. If you're hidden them all, then no one can see what the special thing is about um, your top. Is the blue top with the frill on sleeve oversized? No, it's it's normal sizing. Get you get your normal size. Yeah, I'll it's wear not a, 10. a big fit. It's yeah. actually a fitted. Arm hold, so you need to go your right size. Just go your right size. Down. No, there's no point in going up or down. No, yeah. No, no. Um, it's not designed to be tight anyway, so if you yeah, wear your normal size, your it's just going to skim. It's got a great length, it's really flattering actually. Yeah, but yeah. it is a fabulous stretch. Definitely. Okay, now for those of you who weren't watching yesterday as well, this um, cardigan, it's actually not designed to be tied up, so if you want the longer look, whereas perhaps if you actually are tall and you're wearing this pant, you may want to leave it down. But then if you want to change the length, then you can easily tie it. it up like just like we had before, which we thought was really cute. I just want to say something else about this jacket. I'm going to put it up to it. Mm -hmm. Can I take it off? Mm -hmm. This is what you can do in case you're wondering. You know when you go out and you, you just want something because it's a bit cool, but then you go inside and it's hot, or vice versa. It's hot outside and it's cool inside with the air conditioning. I'll tell you what you can do with this. It just goes to nothing. Yeah, you really want to get inside. those clothes that aren't too chunky. You know when you get a jacket and it's like, you know, and pop it in your bag. Okay, it's not going to be a very small bag, but pop it in your bag. Because look at that. 100%. And it's not going to crush. You just roll it up and it goes to nothing and it comes up looking beautiful. In particular, that jacket is probably really good for travelling. Oh, yes. Well, when Because you can literally sure. throw it but in. But it, it can happen anywhere. It can happen anywhere. I, just, I don't know why I threw that on. I just threw it on. Okay. You can put it on. Why not? Yeah, and you do the knots just to shorten it as we saw probably yesterday. And then you can do each side. You can do both sides, I'll just do one to show you. Okay. Awesome, okay, so then we've got the next outfit with the um, jeans. And again, all these outfits probably would work with the jogger, but I would recommend the front tuck. And they would also all work with the zippy pant for the ones that are long enough to cover that front area. Yeah, you know how all our things go from one to another? So we're showing this in a khaki, just because it went so well with our khaki jacket. Oh, oh, okay. Can you hold? I haven't got enough hands again. This jacket. We're is loving a bit of tone. Yeah, everything tone on tone looks fabulous. Yes, Lisa. They're a straight leg, so they're sort of fitted at the thigh, and then they just go straight down. So they don't taper. They do yeah, a little bit. Get they don't get tighter ankle. at your ankle. Yeah. So yeah. it's the ankle part that's uh, a little bit on the loose side. Actually, now what you can do is also buy a pair of strappy shoes and put the strap over your pant when you're long. Have you seen that? It's uh -huh. cool. Yeah. There we go. Okay, so this is our silky cow blouse, um, and it works so beautifully with this cardigan. We got so excited. Yeah, we got excited. We had to throw it in. We say yes, that's a match made in heaven. And then you can easily. Pop your jean on, and again with your yeah, jean, half tuck maybe for front this one. tuck, side nice. tuck, whatever. You know, it doesn't matter because this pant is not your tight pant. I also think that this particular outfit would look really cool with your jogger. It would look really cool. Just yeah, hang on to that, and I'll grab some shoes. Because I was going to say, you don't want to have. You want to go really contrasting with your shoes when you've got something matchy matchy like this. For sure, it looks much nicer. Yeah, definitely. Make that statement. Yeah, right. Okay, so then. We could. This cardi also looks gorgeous with that. Yeah, these colours look fantastic together. So you can do your straight leg black pan, and again, because this 
shirt is a bit longer. You could actually, if you wanted to do the really tight ones we showed you at the start, the zippy, that would also look awesome with this. So all it does is give you that flexibility as to however you want to wear your tops or however you normally wear your tops, that's probably going to guide you as to which pant you want. So Manza, you are funny. The Jane hanger top, so the bottom one's called Tarzan. Totally, <laughs> absolutely. It's Tarzan, definitely. I'm going to do that. I'm going to stick to that. Okay, so should I try anything on? No. Oh, what I wanted to say was, just hang that. If you happen to be a bit on the short side, but you still love those jeans, you probably need to show a bit more leg. I would do a knot on this. Definitely. A flat knot. 100%. When you're wearing it with that, what was it with the little cardi there? Yeah. Oh, yeah, the cardi, cute. Yeah, really yeah, cute. cute. And do a flat knot. Definitely. And that could even go for the jogger as well. So you can do these blogger shirts in so many ways. Just keep, always keep refreshing and watching as we're always yeah, talking always about. refresh. You get another idea, you add ideas and away we go. And I always love this combo because it's that fabulous cardigan style. And I think this cardigan is so suited to the pear mm -hmm. shapes, but also it's very suited to those with a little bit of height because this is a mid-length cardigan and often we'll have long cardies or short yeah. cardies. If you want that mid-length, this is absolutely perfect. Definitely covers your mutton tops. Mutton tops? Muffin tops. Muffin tops. <laughs> no one would have I say mutton tops. Oh dear. No one that was know. embarrassing. Yeah. Nah. There we go. They don't mind. Uh, yeah, nobody mind. You forgive us. Nobody yeah, cares. Yeah. Actually, did you hear me? You didn't even hear you didn't even so know you, you brought attention to it. Okay, so if you are a little bit taller, this is a really great outfit for you. But again, if you wanted to wear the jogger pant, all you have to do, I think, is pop a little yeah, knot on that. Right? Yeah, that's right. Absolutely. Or, if you want to show off your legs and you like tight pants, you could easily wear the zippy pant because yes, this covers not? the hoo-ha, as Samantha would say. Yeah, that's right. The hoo-ha's covered. You've got everything covered, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, for the tighter leg. So, for a tighter leg, what would you suggest, not the zippy? Okay, there is another pant that we have, Lisa, that um, is basically the same as that but it doesn't have the zip, although I don't think it's in Bangalene at the moment. I think it's called the, the, the pocket jean. I know we've got it in the gingham. It's the one in the gingham. It's like the Benny Oh, right. Pocket. Yes, yes, that's right. It's called online. Sorry. It's called the pocket jean. And if yes. you see, look at the gingham one. There's one like black and white chest. So it's still the tight leg. Same, same thing, but same no zip. Same thing, but no zip. Yeah. Um, some people don't like the, um, the zip. zip. But also, we will be getting that this exact one we will be getting it without zips, we just don't have it yet. It's coming. Yeah, because yeah. I don't think we've got plain colours without a zip, we've only got prints. Okay, well I think we're done now. We're that done! Was mini, that was a mini show. Mm. So we're hoping that no, that's still okay. Over an hour. We're still, what? We're still in over an hour. We've got oh, so no. much to say guys, it's just oh. ridiculous. The more, the, like, look how many garments we've got. Well, well, there was hell to talk about. Okay, we just have too much to say. We've got a lot to say. That's yeah. alright, this is our talking hour. Yeah, that's right. Now so, tomorrow, you are in for a treat. Big treat tomorrow. Because tomorrow we have a little mini capsule. That We're trying is it differently. Gorgeous. We're trying things differently. Definitely. To try and get the hour down. <gasps> doesn't seem to be working. No, it's not working. It doesn't matter. Just, I think it's just good to not, if we have so many things at once, I feel like we don't really get the chance to talk about yeah, them properly. We don't say enough about them and we want to say more. Absolutely. That's really, yeah. So you get the true benefit, really. Exactly. So we're going to be around about an hour because sometimes our capsules are going for like an hour and a half. Yeah, which is fine, least. but for, for the, I don't know, do you have things to do? Probably. I mean, I it's like a movie. It's a, it's a movie, time. all right? Yeah. Is, this a, is this a good time as well? Yeah. Like, you haven't got other things to do. Yeah. Maybe when the kids go to school, we'll have to reassess. Maybe, maybe. You can let us know, yeah. okay? You can let us know. So, Carol, you're perfectly right. Yes, it will be the Friday funnies. We're going to be a bit <laughs> blah, blah, And we're going to have we're a lot to talk about. Tipsy on tea. Tipsy on tipsy tea. Tipsy on tea capsule. We'll call it that. Totally, tipsy totally. Tipsy on tea capsule. But it's all sure tipsy by tomorrow. It's pretty special. So, if you want to see some good stuff, Tune in and we will show you everything then. Mm, that's right. Then I think we're done. Nobody wants anything tried on, just a last little call out. She doesn't want to go. She no, no it's okay. I do want to go, really. You want to hang. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Marlon's right. got nothing else to do. I mean, at the moment we don't. No one's got anything to do, right? Especially us That's right. That's why we're on. Yeah. That's why we're doing this, ladies. Plus, just I want to know, you. what about you girls that are from interstate that can actually do oh, something? Yes. Do you have better things to do or not really? Is this what we're all saying? Well, while we're in ISO, we've got nothing to do, but I feel like this is just the new life. 
don't think that is a bit like that. Yeah. yeah. yeah I mean, we're sticking to Jane and Tarzan. That sounds good. Yeah, Jane and Tarzan. Tarzan yeah, has to be the bottom half, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah, okay. exactly. All right. Okay, guys. Okay.